What's up everyone, welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we are going to put our first modifications. Um, actually a few modifications on my Subaru BRZ and they are all here. And let's open them and show you guys what it is inside. Let's start with this one first. After open it up, you can see here we have a coilover for my Subaru BRZ and they are from Silver, a company called Silver and um, they are one of the first that can confirm they will fit the 2022 Subaru BRZ Yeah, and let's pack them up and send them to the shop and get them installed So the next one here will be the HKS exhaust single axis uh, which is um, purchased from um, Import Image Racing <laughs> Look at this tip <laughs> This is huge and this is single ac axis um, So yeah, let's pack them up too and get them installed in the shop very quick and see them what they what it sounds like after the installation Yeah, let's get right into it Let's go Alright, so here will be everything I forgot to mention. There's also a new set of wheels and they are from Koenig and I just put them on for um, winter and they all have uh, all season tires so I just put them on. I'm trying to get through the winter and I was trying to search for a T37 but they are all like out of stock so I might have to wait until maybe summer and see if I can get one. So of course we won't be able to fit all this into my BRZ. Um, so we will take the RS6 with the BRZ. Let's load everything up and get to the shop. So the BRZ can only fit two wheels into the car. Uh, maybe there's, I, I can fit one more wheels in the passenger seat, but I'm not gonna do that and put all the other wheels in the RS6. Finally, we got the car back from ProSpec Autosport and the car looks really amazing now. Now I kind of like the BRZ front end better than the GRD6 because the front grille of the BRZ now make the car wider compared to the GRD6. And what I have installed is the coilover and wheels and also um, the exhaust. Let's talk about those. So after reloading the car, the car looks really good right now. And move to the side, we have a set of new wheels too. They are Koenig over stair. Um, I find it on Facebook and they are all wrapped in uh, all season tires. And trust me, I promise you guys, this is not gonna be a uh, final wheels for me. Um, these are all the, just for winter use. And I see a lot of people putting 18 times 9.5 on the car. I don't think that's the best spec for the, this car yet because um, if you put those wheels on, you will have to adjust a lot of camber on the car. Um, even with the 18.8, I have to adjust a little bit camber on the car. Um, so I think I will wait for the company to test out all those um, perfect spec for this car. So I will, after that, I will buy a, my final set of wheels. So let's talk about the coilover kit I just installed. They are from Silver. Um, there are Neon Max coilover kit from them and Silver is the one of the first company that made coilover kit for this car and this really changed the car a lot. 
um, so I lower the front by until um, two fingers and back two fingers um, no rubbing at all it's really good for daily driving but after the installation there's some noises coming from the coilover kit we have uh, ProSpec Autosport contact Silver to try to figure out what happened but we couldn't because I, I don't really know um, maybe I just have to live with it and at the back we have uh, most important thing is the exhaust so we have a single axis um, HKS exhaust um, I think this sounds really good yeah I will throw you guys some clip to hear it Oh, sorry my neighbors thing of the exhaust yeah I don't know if the exhaust video uh, captured that um, when you downshifting the car it throw you some pops from the exhaust I really think that really sounds good yeah but I don't think this is a good daily driving exhaust because it kind of drone at 3k rpm so um, I know drone is very um, kind of personal thing um, so it's not for everyone so I'm not daily driving this like a lot um, so this is okay for me so this is going to be today's video and hope you guys like today's video and drop a comment below for what i have done to the car so far and also follow my instagram and subscribe to my channel and thank you guys for watching and see you guys next time